Hey trendsetters, today I'm coming to you from Las Vegas, New Mexico, the other Las Vegas. Today I'm going to conduct a tour around this town. There's the railway station. And this town was also featured in a Netflix TV show. Naturally, I forget the name. So let's kick things off by doing a roll around the railway station, the downtown, and so on. You might be out of here, it's a bit windy today. Thankfully, I'm only cruising around the city, so I won't be dying too badly in the headwinds. There's my steed, the Ridley Canzo Fast for Camp Pignolo's E-Car 1 by 13 speed drivetrain. And you might notice I left the bloody water bottles back in the car. Thankfully, I'm only riding around for an hour or two, so I will somehow survive. Let's look inside the railway station. Welcome to the Amtrak station for Las Vegas, New Mexico. Hello. Hello. So this is the waiting area for trains and so on. What time does the next train arrive for passengers? I'm not sure. That's okay, no big deal. Right next door is the old Castaneda Hotel. Let's go check that out. Love the old signage on these buildings, what they used to house and so on. That's what I'm talking about. Vintage 911 Targa. This is the public service company of New Mexico. Nice building. Welcome to Las Vegas, a state of New Mexico arts and cultural district. Real past, real present, real future. Nice, found a gravel road right in the middle of town. Someone's turned that Chevy into a ute. City of Las Vegas Municipal Court building. City of Las Vegas Museum Rough Rider Memorial Collection. Original Johnny's Kitchen. Looks like it's out of business, unfortunately. On the right, the historic El Fidel Hotel, established in 1920. used to be the Nash Hotel and Apartments. <laughs> 
This is the Las Vegas Fire Department, company number one, and it used to be the City Hall, built in 1892. Gambles, appliances, furniture, hardware, electrical, sports, and tools. And there is the YMCA. Check out this sign on the right Murphy's Drugs, Soda Fountain, Drink Coca Cola. Wooden's Jewelry. 11.22 as you can see from the time Furniture store Gifts and estate sales Some very cool buildings in this town. This building was once upon a time the Bank of Las Vegas, established in 1890. Now it serves as the bank building for the Southwest Capital Bank. Check out this mural. And if memory serves me correctly, Rough Riders had something to do with Teddy Roosevelt. I'm not 100% up with Americano history, folks. This right here is a massive pile of dirty snow. Dick's Pub and Restaurant, and here's an old theater. S-E-R-F, Mama Needs a Cocktail. Post Office fans rejoice. There is the United States Post Office for Las Vegas, New Mexico. Zip code 87701. Notice the flags flapping in the breeze. This building on the right used to be the Post Office and Courthouse. Nowadays it's the Las Vegas City Schools Administrative Offices, home of the Cardinals. Sheriff's Office for Las Vegas, New Mexico. And across the road, an interesting yet abandoned building. The Tudor House. There's plenty of historic homes in this town. I think I'm sort of close to campus. I'd like to remind everybody this is not going to be the most comprehensive tour of Las Vegas, New Mexico. So that gives you good reason to come visit for yourself. But today I'm on a little bit of a time crunch, so just conducting a city tour, no gravelly riding today. On the left, St. Paul's Peace Episcopal Lutheran Church. The New Mexico Highlands University, established in 1893. This is a beautiful building. 
This is the administration building of the campus, Rogers Hall. Right in the centre, I believe, of the university campus. Taco King. I might have to go visit it later on. That's a local establishment. Historic district of Bridge Street. Santa Fe Trail. Plaza Historia, Native and Western American Arts. Plaza Drugs, Herbs, Medical Supply, Oxygen, Soda Fountain. Apothecary, you don't hear that word too often nowadays. Bang drugs, popular dry goods. Here we are, the Kiva, another old theatre in town. Let's do a lap of the plaza. If memory serves me correctly, there are over 900 buildings in this town on the nationally registered list of historic buildings. The Plaza Hotel! City of Las Vegas Police Department. Frankie Antiques. It's a shame to see businesses closed up and so on. Hopefully this town can reclaim some of its former glory. This used to be a textiles building. Navajo Textiles Incorporated. Let's conduct a quick jaunt through the plaza.
Now it happens to be that I'm on the west side of Las Vegas, New Mexico because there's a second post office. There it is, US Post Office, West Las Vegas, New Mexico, 87701. St. Joseph's Hall, erected 1886. Casa Victoria. Number one cuisine. Okay. Here's the story behind the two towns. Well folks, I think it's time to wrap up today's video. This likely wasn't the most comprehensive tour of Las Vegas, New Mexico. But like I said earlier, feel free to visit this lovely little town. Thanks for taking it along and thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the Gravel Cycles YouTube channel. Like the wind noise. And don't forget to click the bell button to be notified of future videos such as this one. Right experience videos, product reviews, and other madness as all of it is released to the channel. I'll see you all in the next video. Amazing, it seems I'm now acclimated to 1,450 meters, almost 1.5 kilometers above sea level, which is very little really.